And just moments ago, the governor of Michigan, the mayor of Flint, the head of the NAACP met behind closed doors to discuss the water crisis in Flint. More on that meeting here in just a minute. First, here is a look at today's new developments. Governor Snyder now asking the federal government for additional health care services for the children and young adults exposed to the lead tainted water. Also, teams from the EPA preparing to collect samples to confirm that lead is being removed by those water filters that they've handed out. And earlier today, children were tested for lead at an elementary school in Flint. Yes, we got a good look at that. Meanwhile, the governor, Flint's mayor, and the national president of the NAACP had a sit-down discussion tonight, and we're expecting more out of the governor tomorrow. But let's get to Mara McDonald. She joined us live in Flint. Any word on what they talked about, Mara? Good evening to you, Carmen. And we hear it was how Flint got here, how Flint's going to get out of this mess, as well as resources for people in this city. Meanwhile, you're right. Be expecting more out of the governor and Flint Mayor Karen Weaver tomorrow morning. While the stream into Flint's water stations is never ending, so are the meetings, the vigils, and the rallies. Tonight, the NAACP and its national president rolled into town for a public forum, while across town, several activists and ministers prepare to recall the governor, which, even though it is likely to go nowhere... It has to send a message because what it has done it has waken up our nation. There is plenty of hostility for Rick Snyder here, but also plenty of blame being heaped on government at all levels. It's not just blaming the state. It's blaming the federal government, which was Jennifer Crooks. It's blaming the state, uh, which was the governor, MDEQ. It's blaming the drain commissioner for trying to force us to go to a KWA pipeline that Flint was not able to afford. It's the mayor, Dane Walling. Flint's new mayor, Karen Weaver, is set for a press conference with the governor tomorrow. Topic number one, money for Flint. And then we need to look at how we're going to prioritize things, what we want to address first. So those are just some of the things. Back here live, as far as that press conference goes, be expecting more about the response here from the state as far as testing the water for lead, as well as National Guard response. Meanwhile, let's also remember that MSNB host, MSNBC host Rachel Maddow brings her show to Flint tomorrow night for a town hall meeting. We'll be here. We are live in Flint tonight. Mara McDonald, Local 4.